Hey everyone, my name is Colin Gillespie, and I'm here talking about some video game news. Um, now, if you guys saw over, I think it was Saturday or Friday, um, that uh, they showed off the new Nintendo 3DS XL. That's basically it's the same thing as 3DS. It's just um, a little bigger, um, has a bigger screen, and a... Um, uh, battery battery life, and I'm thinking about getting it. I haven't decided yet. Um, you know, I know I'm going definitely going to get the Wii U this year. Um, I'm really excited for the Wii U. Um, for a lot of people who are not knowing if they to get this system, I'll tell you why you should get this system. A lot of people are judging it because of what it what the system looks like, the games. Don't do it that way and all. The way I usually do it when I see a new console or new games, I have to I look at the games and seeing what is different than what we have seen before. Yes, there are some games that are same like Batman or Mass Effect um, that are on the new system, um, and you're probably wondering what about all the the good games? Now where are all the good games? Nintendo was not focusing on that. They wanted to basically show up the games on the third party. Because that's what Nintendo uh, was trying to do last year. But everyone asking, where's the third party games? Where's all the good games? This is what they showed off. Now, we know that a Bandai, a Bandai is going to be working with the new Super Smash Bros. game. Um... And I'm curious to see how that's going to work out. I mean, what are they doing on the new game? Will we get some characters from that series onto the new game? It, it, anything could be possible. I'm really curious to see what it is. Um, they announced that Animal Crossing and uh, Fire Emerald will not be coming out this year. I think I was really looking forward to Animal Crossing. You know, I really like that game. Um, I played it on Nintendo DS, I never played it on GameCube, or on the Wii, um, but I'm really curious to see what this game's gonna be like on the 3DS. Um, the, for the 3DS XL, there will be three colors, black, I believe black, red, and blue. Um, I could, I think there's one more, I'm not sure. They're saying white may not come out. I don't know. They showed it off at the, on the video. Um, it is one ninety nine for the three for the three DS. Uh, comes out on the launch of the of new Super Mario Brothers two. Um, I'm definitely gonna pick that up. And I'll, um, I'm I'm a big Mario fan. I, I love Mario. And um. So I'm really curious to see what the system, if what people are going to get the system, or not. Um, other than that, I actually, I think I did one of these videos, I think a while back. I'm not sure. Uh, talking about, I was thinking about selling my Xbox 360. Now, I have all the consoles. I have a PlayStation 3. I have an Xbox 360. I have a Nintendo Wii. I have a 3DS. I have a Vita. And I want to I want to get save up my money for the three D for the Wii U that's coming out this year because we don't know how much this system is going to cost three ninety nine four ninety nine anything is possible and so if it if it is um, like like three hundred ninety nine I will be selling my Wii to get so I can basically put money towards that. Um, but right now, I'm not selling my console. Now, it's, I'll say this, E3 2012 was not that good for some of the conferences. Microsoft, so, Ubisoft won. We all know that. You know, that's, a lot of people are saying Ubisoft won, but everyone has their own opinion. Um... I did like Ubisoft's conference. There's only thing things I really didn't like are the two people hosting it. I really did not like those people. 
I wanted Mr. Caffeine to come back, but uh, to make fun of him again. Um, you know, um, uh, Microsoft. I think Microsoft was the worst, you know, because they were mostly focusing on the tablet or the Xbox Smart Glass. I thought that was kind of stupid. Um, and they didn't show any new IP games. Something we had not seen. I mean, we have seen Halo. We have seen, um, well, we did not see Split Ourselves. But I wanted to see games that was not at Xbox. Basically, they're just focusing on games that mostly people want and all. I won't see games that we haven't seen before, you know, and we knew the next console for the Xbox, the next console for the PlayStation, was not going to be on this E3 conference, and you know, also maybe we'll get to see it next year for the next, the talk about the next generation for new systems, um, you know, I'm very curious to see if people are actually going to sell their consoles to get to buy these new consoles for next year, you know, um, and to me, it's like, it's been over like six years for some of these consoles that have been out, and it's, I'm actually, to me, it felt like, well, I'm still playing these games, I want to play more of these games, you know, and what I'm seeing from PlayStation, I'm loving it, um, act, the only, there's only one game I want for Xbox, and that's Halo. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm a fan of Halo, but I'm not like one of those huge fans. Um, I'm not a fan of Call of Duty. A lot of people are a fan of Call of Duty. I don't like Call of Duty. Uh, I think it's the same thing over and over. It's just pointless. You know, and I see why it makes money and all. Um, I don't play online that much. I only play with my friends. I don't. There's no point in me playing with online, so I don't give a shit about other people. About playing the game. <laughs> I mean, if if I'm playing a game with my one of my friends, saying, "Hey, you want to play online?" I'm like, "Okay." No, but I I won't I won't play games online by myself. I, I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> um. The only games, the reason why I didn't sell my Xbox was there's two games, and they're not uh, big title games. They're not like the big games, not Call of Duty, not Halo, not Gears of War, and it was Banjo Kazooie HD and Fez. Now, um, I saw a couple weeks ago, I saw the indie game movie. And it talked about some of these indie games, and one of those games was Fez, and I actually fell in love with the game, and I fell in love with the soundtrack, and I just loved the game. And I got a chance to play the game up from the demo, and it's fucking awesome. Um, and I'm really excited, I mean, um, right now I'm not selling my Xbox, my uh, Xbox, um... Um, I may sell it, I'm not quite sure yet, but, uh, I mean, right now, there's no, like, any big titles I'm really looking forward to, I mean, I can all play it on my PlayStation 3, I can play Tomb Raider, I can play uh, Alien Colonial Marines, um, but I will play that on the Wii U, um, but, uh, I'm really curious to see what other games we haven't seen before for Xbox, but we're not seeing that. And all um, for the Wii U, um, a lot of people are judging it from what they see, and I don't think they should try to do that. Th these are some of these games you may know, but you may not know. Um, Zombie U, that is like one of their big titles, and what if you just watch the demo of that game? And holy shit, it looks fucking awesome. It looks awesome. I love the game, you know, from what I'm seeing. And one of my friends, uh, who's on from one of the websites I go to, Spill.com, 
um, is a big Nintendo fan, just like me. But uh, most of the games I like, he does not like. And, uh, and he wasn't excited for the, like, uh, for GameCube or the Wii. But for this system, oh my god, he said, yeah, but I like this system. I'm like, really? Wow! <laughs> um, excuse me. Um, other games are looking really good. Assassin's Creed 3. They say it's the best version on the Wii U. So I'm, I'm basically agreeing with those people because it's a, it has a bigger map and it has more, a better way to play the gameplay and all. Um, and I'm really excited for this game. Um, uh, my top, if you, my top five games or top six are Zombie U, uh, New Super Mario Brothers, um, uh, Pikmin 3, um, there's something else, Assassin's Creed 3, um, I think that's four or five, I don't know. I don't keep track. <laughs> uh, but, uh, there's many others. Uh, Rayman Legends. Um, but, there's the other games that they had, had they announced, like, Tank Tank Tank, uh, sorry, Tank Tank Tank. That's, or, uh, the new project they, um, that, uh, Platinum Games is working on. That they, uh, didn't show up at the conference. They basically talked about, it's, it's kind of like Pikmin, but a little different. Um, but they're all looking good, and I'll basically go to the, if you guys want to know, go to the Nintendo website, and go to the E3, uh, section, and just watch some of these videos of these games, and they're, look so much fun, and I'll, um, I like the new controller, it's a, it's basically a gamepad controller, that's what it's called, um, and I'm very excited for this new console. And I'll um I, I I'm gonna hope I'm wanna get this system really right now. I want to play this now. <laughs> um but I think my biggest game out of all of them has to be between Assassin's Creed three and Pikmin three. It's one of those two. You know, it's so hard to choose which one I really like. I mean, I love Rayman, Rayman Let or uh or uh Rayman uh oh sh I just forgot the name <laughs> Rayman the pre the, the game before of Rayman um Rayman Origins yeah there it is <laughs> um the game was when the first time I played it it was awesome and I got a chance to play it this year and all the game came out last year and I love this game and I'm thinking better on the Wii U Fuck yeah. And uh, so I'm really excited. So hopefully you guys will agree with me. Don't judge it from what you see. You have to play it in your hands you know, to judge it. Because you know, a lot of people do that. They just judge it from what they see. You know, don't do that. You, know, you have to play it from in your hands and play the games. Um, I mean, I still have a lot of questions for the Wii U. Um, what, is, what is the... Can you transfer data from, like, a transfer games from they like bought on your Wii to your Wii U? Um, and can, because I want to play, like, some old Super Nintendo 64. I want GameCube. I don't care what people say. GameCube is not, people don't like GameCube. I fucking love GameCube. You know, Luigi's Mansion or playing Super Mario Sunshine. Yes, I like those two games. <laughs> um, so, I, I want more Nintendo, give it to me, <laughs> um, so, and I'm just really curious to see what you guys' opinion, please comment below, subscribe, uh, more updates will be, uh, for my new video games, I don't know, I will be doing walkthroughs, um, pretty soon, I need to get the, the device, like, I checked it on Amazon, like, 169, I think, um, so hopefully I can get to do that, uh, do it this year, uh, so if you guys have any video game walkthroughs you'd like me to try to do, um, for Nintendo, Sony, Microsoft, 
or uh, Steam, um, so let me know in the comments below, because um, I'll play any type of games. Um, the only games I do not play are sport games. Some sport games I will play, like the Mario Sports, I love those. Um, SSX or Tony Hawk. I don't play racing. I don't like racing. It's not my type of game. So, um, other than that, I really don't have anything else to say. So, like it. I don't care. It's up to you guys. So, talk to you guys later. Have fun.